welcome back with another rom review finally we have another latest update of casa os 2.2 from this month okay let's get it started with full review watch till the end i will share every single details about that custom rom this is based on android 10 you guys already know and this is the user interface of settings uh, which is already changed a bit different now okay when you want to uh, see the about section just click on that icon and the wallpaper will be shown here which you are currently using on your device here we have device name and other gpu cpu system everything is here and camera every details and we have here the recent change logs uh, okay uh, owner information and uh, device information if you need device information then we have the firmware information we have android version 10 casa which is uh, now in sisu and version 2.2 maintainer is really, really thanks to him for this official update and if you're using the older one of course you can go with this if you were using a 2gb ram devices then i can blindly recommend you guys to that to custom rom you guys can try this casa os of course and if you are uh, running out of ram then this is gonna be the best choice for you uh, the android version is 10 but we have uh, new features on that and new updates and new security update everything is available in that custom room so you guys can go with that and we have android security patch level which is july 5 very very latest okay then we have the internet and connectivity then we have the display section okay uh, just like the same as before and we have adaptive brightness like and other things everything is just working fine here But then we have the final thing which is give casa that means the customization hub we have the regular customization we have status bar traffic indicators perfectly working and ticker status bar lyric as usual the regular customizations all are there then we have the theme you guys can select that one theming that means we have some accent color uh, which is the amount i'm using right now here you guys can see these are the theming actually and we have the font uh, we don't have any extra fonts just uh, two or three like this and then we have the icon shapes you guys can change just three icons pack are available here then we have the wi-fi icon level and i'm using here the xperia right now and signal icons also using the xperia right now these are the theming actually then we have the quick settings brightness slider and qs footer quiz footer text if you need to add qs footer text that means if you want to see here something then you guys can add then settings icon of course user switcher icon edit icon then we have the color notification headers icon uh, then are just rounded corner content uh, padding here increase the number of icons in qqs is uh, up to you which one you, uh, the amount you want you can set and rows and columns style duration interpolation which is called animations just like this you guys will get that i'm using the flip one okay then we have the buttons then we have the gestures uh three fingers swipe so screenshot is working fine no problem then we have the lock screen uh, status bar and battery info charging animation which is flash we have some charging animation actually explosion uh, then we have the water you guys can set according to your choice no problem then you have the quick settings double tap to sleep a fingerprint authentication vibration okay then we have the notification as usual force expand notifications then a high toast uh, smart replies okay then we have here's up uh, enable heads up notifications are enabled okay then we have the animations if you want to turn off disable transition animation you can do that then we have the battery section battery customizations as usual aggressive battery mode then we have auto enable on battery saver which is turned on then we have the miscellaneous okay sensor block per package we have a very important feature which is allow application downgrade and we can add block and gaming mode and z visual mode everything is fine here which is called z visual mode status bar height can be customized rounded corner which is default status bar height uh, medium large extra large you can set 
screen delay screenshot delay time you can say zero seconds of course allow signature spoofing and uh, newly added here use storage encryption spoofing it spoofs storage encryption status to encrypt it okay this is good these are the features actually we have in keep casa then as usual the storage security we have the important features like fingerprint face unlock and app locker as well everything is just awesome here no problem with that and room is very very smooth and another uh, improvement is here in call recorder okay by default you guys will get auto call recorder implemented here which is auto call recording is on here okay fine everything is good now okay let's talk about as it is based on android 10 so we have the control center just like android 10 as usual and the smoothness is just just awesome mind blowing here no no issues with that okay let me show the app opening and closing animation which is very much faster and of course you can easily use the google camera is perfectly working as it is android 10 but it can handle any g cam you guys can easily use no issues with that and we don't have any problem with uh, youtube and other things which is perfectly okay and i'm using here the app uh, uh, which is called app locker and perfectly working okay let me show you that the very important thing is that i'm just using that room from the morning and the cpu throttle to 71 percent uh, if i want to uh, make it stable i must use that room for some days and then it will be stable okay another important thing which is google photos unlimited storage is perfectly working no issues with that okay now let me show you the geekbench score remember one thing this is based on android 10 but we have the latest updates on it so this is through 64 single core and triple nine multi-core as based on android 10 and if i want to check this again tomorrow then i will get far better than this okay and blindly i can recommend you guys without any problem this is very very stable custom rom right now you guys can go with that if i miss anything then let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching